This is your extremely simple brine shrimp hatchery. It's a five gallon tank with a 25 watt heater. Two soda bottles with the tops cut off and air stones to move the water. A lid is important as the air stones will make mist and you'll get salt crust pretty much everywhere. And this is my cat who wants to help out. Um, you don't need to have the water with the heater. What that does is makes it so the brine shrimp eggs hatch faster. With the heater it'll take about 24 hours for the brine shrimp eggs to hatch. Without the heater it'll take closer to 48 hours. Now as you can see this one on the left is more orange than the one on the right. The one on the right I cultured this morning and this one has been cultured probably a day ago because um, I like to alternate only harvest for two or three days and then dump it out and make a new one. You'll still have brine shrimp left over but the most nutrients are in the newly hatched ones. Um, so you just keep alternating which one you started and which you're harvesting from. So as you can see they're, they're hatched so you get a nice orange color. Um, you do if you don't use the water and the heater, you do want to make sure you put them in something with a lid to prevent the salt spray. So, to get it started, you just need your 2 liter bottle with the top cut off. You need a container of brine shrimp eggs. Um, these I got from Brine Shrimp Direct, and I believe these are the Great Salt Lake Origin ones, but I also have a container of the San Francisco Bay. These are the smallest that you can get on Brine Shrimp Direct. Um, they are 1.75 ounces, but they will last you quite a while. A lot of people refrigerate their eggs to make them last longer, but I go through them so fast that I don't really bother. Um, from, when they come from Brine Shrimp Direct, they come with a scoop. Um, I tend to do one scoop per two liter. Um, I've got a thing of aquarium salt here. This is just your standard aquarium salt. Um, nothing special about it. It's not marine salt, it's just aquarium salt. But I have heard that marine salt results in a better hatch rate. Um, I do one and a half teaspoons of the aquarium salt. And then I use a very small pinch, just that scoop, of baking soda per two liter bottle. So I just put all the stuff in and that they are stone going and in 24 hours I have shrimp ready to harvest. So that's the hatchery. Next I'll show you how to harvest them.